Hi, Caleb with Brownhouse here. In today's quick tip, we're gonna be talking about why wolf gray is the best color, period. That's a all facts, no opinions. Uh, no, I'm just kidding, guys, but seriously. Uh, we've been getting a lot of questions because these last two builds uh, that I did here that we've kind of been showing a lot, uh, just in random videos and then B-roll uh, for videos and stuff. Uh, we've got a lot of questions like, hey, what shade of gray is that? Uh, you know, and why are you painting all your guns gray? Uh, and I can answer both of those questions for you here in this video. Uh, so if you've seen any of the stuff I've done, you know, firearm wise, you've obviously seen these guns. Uh, if you've seen any of my stuff I do at the range on social media and different things like that, you also know that I have wolf gray gear that I wear as well. Uh, my actual tactical game rig is a black multicam with wolf gray pouches. Um, so wolf gray, I'll just say right now, uh, if, as the kids say, if you want the most drip on your firearm, wolf gray is the color to go. Uh, but in all seriousness, moving on from there, I really like the color. It kind of stands out from just your traditional, you know, black gun AR-15. Uh, take this, you know, BRN 180, for example. Uh, people know what the BRN 180 is, but whenever I painted this 180 in Brownells Aluma High 2 Wolf Gray, which is what both of these guns are painted in, um, got a lot of questions on it. People didn't even really recognize the gun because they're used to seeing that, pla that black BRN 180. I was like, hey, this Wolf Gray, um, it's still a BRN 180, but it just makes everything stand out a little bit more. And, and, uh, Within all the ranges of the 50 shades of gray, uh, wolf gray is definitely the best because it goes with a lot of other colors. Like for example, uh, take this green here, I'll just kind of hold it so you can contrast it around that wolf gray. So if you were gonna go like wolf gray with a different color accessory uh, like this here, it would look really good, it'd blend well. I know some of you guys are watching this right now saying, this guy's disgusting, why is he blending these colors? But I think it looks good. And uh, that's all that matters. So whatever color you want to paint your gun and you think looks good, uh, that's all that really matters. It's, it's the point of this is customizing it to you, not to anyone else. And uh, not to mention, all you uh, Flat Dark Earth Society guys out there, it looks great with Flat Dark Earth as well. All right, so that's all I got for y'all today. The point of this being, not that Wolf Gray is the best, but the whole premise of this video is that Whatever color you want to paint your gun or whatever color you think looks best is the only one that matters. It's your gun. It's not anyone else's. So with that being said, if you have any questions or comments, I'm sure you do, please post them down below. If you have a favorite color for your AR-15 gear, whatever, let us know in the comments down below. I'd like to see kind of what, what you guys are, are feeling on this. But as always, uh, if you have any questions, feel free to give us a call on the tech line. And if you haven't already, because of the way YouTube algorithms and things work, especially with the firearm industry, go ahead and hit that like and subscribe button. Thanks for joining us, and we'll see you next time.